Hey guys, I welcome you all to my YouTube channel Gardening Paradise and hope you all would be doing great. Uh, so today we are diving into the wonderful world of propagating plants from cuttings in April. If you are ready to expand your garden with minimal effort, you are in the right place. Let's get started. Before going further, a small request to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to get the notification about my new videos. April brings warmer temperatures and the perfect conditions for propagating plants from cuttings. It's an excellent time to take advantage of nature's bounty and expand your garden with new green additions. So today we'll explore some plants that you can easily grow from cuttings during this season. Let's begin with an herb that's staple in many gardens, mint. Mint is incredibly easy to propagate from cuttings. Simply snip a few stems from a healthy mint plant, remove the lower leaves and place them into a glass of water. In a few weeks you will notice roots starting to form and you can then transplant them into pots or directly into your garden. Next up we have coleus, known for its vibrant foliage and easy propagations. Take stem cutting from a mature coleus plant, remove the lower leaves and place them in moist potting soil. Keep the soil consistently moist and in a few weeks you will have new coleus plants ready to thrive in your garden. Geraniums are another popular choice for propagation. Take stem cuttings from a healthy geranium plant, remove the lower leaves and dip the cut ends in rooting hormone powder. Plant the cuttings in a well draining potting mix. Keep them in a warm and bright location and watch as new roots develop over time. Pothos, also known as devil's ivy or most popularly as money plant, is a versatile and low maintenance plant that perfect for beginners. Simply snip a few vine cuttings from a mature pothos plant, place them in water and wait for roots to develop. Once the roots are established, you can transfer the cuttings to pots filled with potting soil. Last but not the least, we have jasmine, known for its fragrant blooms and graceful vines. Take semi hardwood cuttings from a healthy jasmine plant. Remove the lower leaves and dip the cut ends in rooting hormone powder. Plant the cuttings in a mix of perlite and peat moss. Keep them moist and in a few weeks you will have a new jasmine plants ready to adorn your garden. Before you starting propagating, make sure to use clean sharp scissors or pruning shears to take your cuttings. Remove any flowers or buds from the cuttings to encourage root development. And consider using rooting hormone powder to speed up the process. Keep the cuttings in a warm and bright location and be patient. Propagating takes time but the results are well worth it. And there you have it, a beginner's friendly guide to propagating plants from cuttings in April. Whether you are a seasoned gardener or just starting out, propagating plants from cuttings is a rewarding and budget friendly way to expand your garden. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more gardening tips and share your favorite plant to propagate in April in the comments below. Happy gardening and I'll see you in my next video.